let's try this again. Borik is less. I think it's Bjork or Bjork. Good, you got a better one than I did. I think this will be a good year for you, Kalia. Why aren't you reading? Some are some wolves. They are. They are a very good shit movie. Wait, isn't that? <gasps> Yuya! Yeah. Happy new so happy new salutations, Melanie. It is you! Happy happy new salutations to you two! Ah. Uh. To meet you on the first day of the new year. It's a good omen indeed. Did you come alone? Not exactly, no. I was looking for someone, but I seem to have lost sight of them. You're just as suspicious as always, Yuya. But I found you instead, so I can't say this was a wild goose chase, Lonely. I shall go thank the gods of this shrine for this fated encounter. Adieu! <laughs> Jeez! Sorry. Water, please. Ice thank you, girl. It's not that heavy. We're gonna have to buy more some of these so we can get you another bottle. Mm -hmm. mm. <sighs> and so he sauntered off with a dashing wave. I guess he was in a hurry. We knew you won. I have needed. What a shot. <laughs> Focus. It's still light out, so maybe I'll go somewhere before I head home. Way! Although we're near the end. Yeah, but just in case. Way. Oh, tomorrow's Lungumen time, so we'll buy some bands. Boys, give beans to the boys who like. This black bean mix. <laughs> Let's check. It's black bean. Yeah. Sometimes my memory does me well. Most of the time it does not, though. I'll take these. Thank you, miss. Here you go. I want to get... See, sometimes it stops when there's new shit. Mm -hmm. I want to go give you your beans, but... I don't even know if he's at school today. I guess I'll have to call him. I have a phone? He has a phone? Salutations, Monique. He answered. Hello, how are you, Yuya? Where are you right now? I'm fine, but alas, I cannot say where I am. The best man always has a mystery of 2000, after all. Do you need me for something? Um, can we meet up for a bit? Please? I'll only ask this once. A once in a lifetime request, in other words. Really? A once in a lifetime? Plus plenty more times for the same lifetime request! Well, that sounds important. I can't exactly say no now, can I? Shall we meet at the usual place in the park tonight? Say hey. Okay. All these nighttime booty calls. Yuya! I hope I didn't keep you waiting. Time spent waiting for a lady's magical, irreplaceable time. Pay it no mind, one me. Unfortunately, I do not have much time left today. Forgive my lack of romance, but may I ask what you wanted to meet with me for? Oh, yes! It's Lingoomin times, so I wanted to give you this. You wanted to give me beans, mon ami? Yes! Oh, how wonderful! I am glad I risked my life to come here. I thought maybe your mature, manly spirit would like these. Little black beans. Thank you, Molly. I have loved these since I was but a child. 
I don't do that. Nope. My hunter-gatherer instincts never fail. I see. I wonder if we truly are bound together by fate. How romantic. This gives me hope and caffeine to carry me through this darkest of nights. This oh, I do want to be. And so he disappeared into the night. I can't say I have any more of an idea what he's up to than I ever do, but I'm glad he liked the beans. Silver lining. The semester is almost over, and a few short she short she 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 sophomore. I haven't seen Yuya since New Year's. Apparently, he hasn't come to school all semester. There are rumors that he dropped out, but could that really be true? I feel like a hole has opened up in my heart. I think I'll go drown my sorrows in arcade games. Sounds, yeah, yeah, sounds about right. Mm -hmm. I'd do it. Gaming. Gaming. The way to lift every person's heart. <laughs> Wait, isn't that... Yuya! You know me? You, you look like you're doing pretty well. <laughs> I, uh... I have some stuff to do. I do. Hey, hey! Okay, here we go. Whoa, 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 wait! Was that enough words? Sure. <laughs> uh, Javala, could you not grab me so tightly? <laughs> You'll crush me with your size. Huh? Yuya, is your ring bra? Whoa! Out. <laughs> is your wing bra? <laughs> Bruh! 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 You wing! <gasps> a gunshot! Opening fire on the lady! Such insufferable cads they are! This way, Molly! Run! Yuya, yeah, what's going on? Please explain yourself! What are you? Why are people trying to kill you? Are you a wanted man? I. I suppose I can't really say you're not involved anymore, can I? Next time I explain. Do you know of the Hawk Party and the Dark Party, Lodi? The Hawk Party is the one who, when we didn't touch butts with a bird, it killed us. And we were a failure. I don't know about the Dove Party. The political factions? Right. They were names used in human politics. But now they carry a different meaning. The Dove Party believes we should live peacefully with the remaining humans, while the Hawk Party believes we should exterminate them to make room for birds. There are more birds than there are humans in this world? Well, they, we did see that. Ruin human, yeah. yeah. Sing Pigeon Nation, this is actually a secret energy. Experimental Institute created by the Hawks. Whoa! Wait, the Hawks are the... The Doves want to keep humans around, but Hawks are like, kill them all. So why would they make a, a super base? Where they kill pigeons. And humans. Because we're an experiment and they killed us. Mm. Me... I, I mean, I guess the idea could be breeding, but that wouldn't really help because it was Roman. There was no sex. Right. So, what's, what benefit is there to having us there? And yeah, if they're, the idea is that we want to make room for humans, then again, they might just be there to investigate who is killing. Because it doesn't say that the doctor is part of the heart, Hawks party. True. So the Hawks might be like, hey, there's a human at the school and birds are going missing. Mm. Is it the human? And they're yeah. gonna try and blame us. Maybe. <coughs> anyway. <coughs> well, what? Of course, it's not like the entire the faculty is working for them. There's only one clock agent actually working at the school. Janitor? By contrast, I was dispatched by the doves to infiltrate the school and investigate the experiments. Okay. As you said, I'm a wanted man. <laughs> I'm proud to live up to that title. I'm an experiment at clandestine information retrieval. And information is valuable. Expert. 
I'm an expert. Wait, so he's part of the dev party, mm -hmm. and he's working with the janitor, so the janitor's not part of the Hawks party, so the doctor is in the Hawks party? That's my guess. Or it's Why some... is he killing his own people? Yeah. I imagine you've already realized why I was acting as a helper in the infirmary. Because the Hawk agent... Oh, that's me. Because the Hawk agent is... is Dr. Ihonine. Correct. Yumine is no doubt an assumed name. He's a researcher for the Hawk Party and has been developing anti-human biological weapon using data collected during physical examinations. Then why is he killing <laughs> killing the birds? Remember when we bumped into each other at the school shop? Yes, I think we... I was investigating where the products sold there come from. I found that DNA samples from the pen were matched. Were matched there, matched samples taken from missing students. Same goes for much of the fault tree in the cafeteria. Ugh. That's horrible! But if the doctor was out to experiment, exterminate humans, why did he never do anything to me? Hmm, this is just my interpretation, but I don't think he holds any political ideas. I don't think he trusts only in his own knowledge and his own power. Bless! Bless! Thank you. And his own power to expand that knowledge. Mm. So in other words, he just wants to experiment. Yeah, so the hawk party was probably like, stop killing birds, and he's like, bitch, you can't stop my knowledge. Mm -hmm. Something like a mad scientist, maybe? Exactly. I suppose it never occurred to him to target you, since you were working for him. I think he was more interested in observing your interactions with the other students. <clears throat> I wanted to reveal the hawk's involvement in the school, but... In the end, it proved too much for me alone. And now, well, I can no longer live in the open. I plan to leave this city tonight. But, I can't just leave you. I don't know if I can just leave you here, Dwala. Kyuya! You may already have been marked as one of my associates, and if that is the case, then leaving you alone would be dangerous. I'm sorry I got you involved in all this, Melanie. Hardly. I was the one who approached you. You don't need to apologize. <laughs> You're such a nice girl. Thank you. Hmm. I'll let you decide. Do you want to come with me into the world of darkness? Or would you rather live a normal life? Of course. If you want to stay, I'm assigned agents to protect you. Whisk me away. I, I want, want to. Go with you, Yuya. Go with you, Yuya. I want to go with you. Are you sure? You may be putting your life at risk. Don't make me say it twice. Somehow, I was hoping you'd say that. I haven't been this happy in a long time. There's nothing more keeping us here, then. Let us go, Monique. And so I followed Yuya into the world of darkness. Sometime in the future, a pair of spies in their endless battle for justice behind the frail curtain of society will pass into legend. But that's another story. Okay, so we became international spies. Sunny, shut up. Cool. <laughs> Alright. Sure! Okay. Well, that was an ending. Do, 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 do. Oh, Yuya only lives to only live live twice. Live. Live twice? Yeah, it's a twist on a James Bond. Only live once. Mm -hmm. I think. I think it's James Bond. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Shall we go on the next one or should we stop for today? I feel bad because I know this is 
Oh god Oh god What is this do? Uh, I'm not sure. It's either at the end of this month or the beginning of the next. It's because we still have Okusan and then the secret people. With Okusan, the teacher, the doctor, and then two secret people, and then the pro, the epilogue, where it like comes all together. We can pause for now. Yeah. Take like an hour break. Hey, Sam. I just like story to story. Dude, does his look exponentially shorter? Here's another bird with two endings. Attend gym class every day. I'm not actually sure if this matters, but do it just to be safe. I've listed the two different answers you can give to change between the normal end and the true end. Although swapping another silly swapping other silly questions should also work. Just don't blame me if you try it. Again, you need both to unlock BBL at epilogue. So until next time, get Okosan's ending of Pudding Odyssey. Get Okosan's full ending. And they give us... Wait. How do we... Oh, okay. There's only one question, and it happens on August 3rd. That has... that changes the ending. So we would save just before that? We have another drawer, shall we at least do that? Reference bird deceased. The death of Subject Zero Zero's rel relative has been confirmed. His remains are stored in Area D3, Section 1. They are boxed and processed. We have a lot more boxes than we have endings. Because we have two endings with Oko. Doctor, teacher, secret, secret. Two, there's two for the doctor? Another for the doctor. It's eight. Did you miss No. There were two endings for Shirogane. But we only got one box, because we finished four dudes now, right? We did Ryota, who only has one. Mm -hmm. And uh Sukuya. Mm -hmm. There's two, but we only got into the night, I think. No, we got both. You got both? Yeah, we got uh and then Nanaki. Nanaki and Yuya. Who both only have one. Cuckoo! I think we'd be doing a lot of cuckooing. <sighs> yeah. All right, let's do this. Okay. We'll do a new game just to be safe. Oh wait. Uh, we... we have to join the track team. Just, I'll just do this to be safe. J E. Sunship time. Ooh, sorry. Uh, while we get to the relevant part, what do you think the story is? Uh, for Oko-san? Look, just overall, because obviously there's some kind of like 
overall thing. And it did mention a person's body parts were made. Mm -hmm. That could probably... Obviously, it could be someone we don't know. But from what Obviously. we do know, it could be any of the students that were killed by Doctor. Or it could be Nageki. Mm. Yeah. Oh, this one's the hottest. <laughs> Every time I see his picture, I'm like, oh, right, oh gosh. So hot. Oh, so beautiful. Uh huh. Okay. Is it fun? I need a fun. Just what do we do? Uh, gym, gym class. Always gym class. Hey. We don't do enough to insult Oko-san by taking <laughs> something as such as math. Who needs math? I had to sit out the wing training, but it was fun anyway. Maybe someday I'll be able to fly too. Nothing's gonna be able to kill us at the end of it. <laughs> got so much vitality. <laughs> Buff the heck out. I need to go sign up for track. I want to join the team, but I wonder if Okasan's having a fit again. I'll find out when I get there. This is gonna hurt my voice. Cuckoo! The Javala has appeared! Is this a cha challenge then? Choose your weapon, ma'am, and draw! A fit he is having, though not over pudding. Not really. I want to join the team. Do you know where the captain is? Coo! He stands before you! Oko-san is the captain, and a faster bird the world has never known. I never knew. Oh, well, here, my forms. Thank you. Cool. A dove never refuses a challenge. Commence the entrance examination. There's an exam? Cool, of course. Track is in Daisy Jane making Missy. Cool. Okosan will be your opponent in noble combat. Sprint or long distance? Long distance. Uh, uh, long distance. Cool! Long distance. You've got guts. Let us begin. Go, go! On your marks. Get set. Go, go! You see what I did there? <laughs> How is he so fast? He can't even fly this fast. <sighs> go! You're still weak, but you've got potential. Welcome to the team! Thanks? Cool, that's all, folks. And so I joined the track team. Who knew doves could run like that? He is very, very, very aerodynamic. Mm -hmm. uh, sitting at home is so relaxing. Oh, tomorrow is the class hike. I should prepare. Ba ba ba. We're taking a break. I should talk to. Son. Son? Oh, Uncle Son! Is his name Oko Sang? Wait, it should say there in the guide. You going up? Oko Sang, until next time, a pudding odyssey. Oh, it's just Oko. His, his, his name is Oko Sang. Oko Sang. Oko Sang. Oko Sang. I wonder where Oko Sang went. I haven't seen him since we stopped here. Go! Go! It's not here! The pudding is not here! It's missing? Did you bring it to eat for lunch? Cool! No! Okosan believed that wonderful pudding could be found on hikes! What? No. Is there a kind of pudding that lives in the mountains? <laughs> cool! Okosan will now search elsewhere for the pudding! And he's gone. <laughs> what kind of pudding is he looking for anyway? Are we gonna win his heart by making him pudding? <laughs> or are we gonna break his heart because we'll make him pudding? It'll be like, this is a disgrace to pudding, ma'am. Be gone. <laughs> it's too hot. I feel like I'm gonna have a stroke. Cool. It is rehydration time. 
Oko-san wants to go swimming! It's not what that means, but okay, whatever. You have to ingest in order to dehydrate. <laughs> The insides that are dehydrated. Where's your underwear? Sports festival. Uh, fall, or did you just suck? You're scared to skip, aren't you? Yeah, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm afraid to have the tunnel chance. Uh, can't possibly expect a race. Have a chill it in. In general, no. Okay, what do you want to do? I don't know. I'll decide later. Oh shit, it's later. I need to decide. Okay. I should go do the marathon. Cool! You're running the marathon too, Javala! Yep! Someone needs to act as female representate. Re, as female representative. Good luck, Okosan! Cool! Never worry, never fail! Okosan never brings up the rear! <laughs> <laughs> Swift as the wind as usual. I think he came in first, but I can't see from here. I'd better do my best too. Was that us? Did we zoom? Oh shit, we're zooming! <laughs> okay, pause.